Alrighty, starting up the stream, receiving content. Should be good to go here. Alright, so where were we? Uh, we need to go up there and talk to, it looks like Hapu's up there. Salazzle, hello. Alpha, hello. Christian, hello. How are you guys? Septile Swag, hello. How are you? You guys are here fast. <laughs> Salazzle's like, no, I was here first. How is everyone tonight? We're picking up right where we left off last night. So we need to head up and... Oh, look, there's Nebby. You were close. <laughs> Alpha is... Hunting for shiny dusk lichen rock. Well, good luck, Alpha. Good luck. So, Lazel, how has the search gone for your shiny female Salandit? Can we try it again? You have an executor with harvest and skills. Okay, well, good luck. I hope that you can get it this time. How long have you been at it? <laughs> yeah, I guess you are waiting, huh? It's like as soon as I uh, started the stream, it was like all of a sudden, boom, it was like four or five people. It's pretty cool. Pretty awesome. Hello, Multi. How are you? Welcome back, Christian. Yes, we were watching you, Hapu. There's Honor, Kahuna, but he died suddenly some years back. I tried to follow him in Swiss but I was not chosen by the Tapu back then. You have so many roto hatches? <laughs> That's good though. Indeed. I like Hapu. She's pretty cool. Tell us about the legendary Pokemon. Lunala, yeah. Tell us about Lunala. Two hours so far? So you still got a while until you get back to where you were yesterday, because that one went for a long time, right? You said you started at like 2 or 2.30 yesterday, and at least when I was streaming it was about 7 or 8, so that was like 6 hours yesterday, so... Six hours. <laughs> you almost ran out of roto hatches when hatching for a shiny dusk lichen rock. I have yet to use, I think, any of my roto powers. I should do that. Ceremony, legendary flute, and the Pokemon. This is a sun flute. Executor Island. I think I've heard about it before. Fish Boy, hello, how are you? You're good? Glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. Glad you could stop by and hang out. <laughs> we're just continuing what we were doing yesterday. Um, apparently I need to go to Exeggutor Island right now. I'm gonna go up. Nothing happens, right? I just go up and click this. Okay, so nothing happens right now. So yeah, uh, looks like we need to go to Exeggutor Island. Don't get eaten by Shark Master Fish. <laughs> I 
Oh, so you lowered the... Okay. And it helped out. Well, that's good to hear. I'm glad it helped. Oh, Rotom? Thank you, guys. Oh, Roto Power. And, alright. I still don't know it. Roto Catches. Okay. I don't have them memorized yet, what they look like, like what they mean. <laughs> Alright, so we need to go to Executor Island, I guess. Um, yeah, probably. That's probably how we get there. I was wanting to look at my map. Okay, thank you. So yeah, we gotta go back to Seafolk Village. Let's just fly over there. I think Christian is a little bit older than you, Salazzle. And I'm the oldest. Pretty sure that I'm the oldest. Seafolk Village. Alpha's probably the youngest? Eh, maybe. And there's Hapu and Mudsdale. Christian's three years younger than me. Alright, Journey to Executor Island. We should speak with Mina. She can help arrange a boat for you. Wishing you safety. Thank you. Goodbye, Hapu. Goodbye, Mudsdale. <laughs> yeah, I always... I always get told that I look young, which is good. It'll help when I'm older. When I'm 50 and I look like I'm 38 or something. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> Gonna guess 19? I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> Alpha's the youngest. Executor Island. Let's go. Chief. Nice to meet you. I'm Chief of the Sea Folk. Could help overhearing that you're going to Executor Island. Yes, we are going to Executor Island. Can we get there? It doesn't need to be a crazy long cutscene. We just want to go to Executor Island. Lazzle's right. It does suck to be an adult. You got a job, but you got to go to work all day. You come home, and most of that money that you made ends up going toward bills and stuff. And it's like, oh my gosh, I just want to have fun. We're in a magic carp little thing. This is kind of fun. This reminds me of Team Rocket's magic carp submarine from back in the day. Now, you guys remember when Team Rocket used to cruise around in their magic carp submarine? Oh, there's the flute right there. So we gotta get up to it, I guess.
Look at the exact they are. <laughs> oh, they're so goofy. Worked up than usual. Noisy bunch. Good luck. All right, thanks, Chief. All right, so we got Executor up there. Let's see, Pokemon. <laughs> Bugs that you need some XP. Magikarp Submarine was lit. I agree. Magikarp Submarine was really cool. Hello, Executor. Thwack! Fight. Can we catch this guy? Oh, it's a pincer. A wild pincer appeared. Calm down in Pokemon. <laughs> so we got a pincer. Um, Dazzling Gleam. All right, and the red critical hit. Not very effective. Let me catch this guy. Let's catch him. Let's go with a... Let's try a nest. No, not a nest. A netball. <laughs> oh, man. Thought we had it. Submission, not very effective. Damage by the recoil. Let's see here. Let's try. I guess I'll try a great ball or a. Let's try an ultra ball. Ultra ball. I try to be careful when I'm scrolling through my Pokeballs because I've got a fear of accidentally clicking on my Master Ball and like throwing a Master Ball at a pincer. <laughs> like, I don't want to use my Master Ball on a pincer. Pincer's data was added. I always thought Pincer was pretty cool. The Mega's pretty cool. Septile Swag, hello again. How are you? Don't waste the Master Ball, I know. I'm so afraid if I click too quickly that I'm going to accidentally click on it. Although it's tough, it can't handle cold well. When night falls, it buries itself in leafage and sleeps. Hmm. No nickname, but let's take a look at the summary and just kind of see here. Uh, okay, Mold Breaker. Hmm, okay. Let's send this guy to the box. Alpha still has her Master Ball. Are you saving it for anything, Alpha? Do you have anything in mind that you want to use it for, or are you just waiting for the... Just waiting for the right moment. So I guess we gotta defeat the stuff that is bugging these Executor. So, let me... Helen, if there are more pincer, I think your flying type moves will be helpful. You caught Necrozma with a quick and Solgaleo with a dust ball. Nice. Get more than one master ball. Yeah, I heard about that, Christian. I haven't done that, but I heard about that. All right, so let's just go ahead and knock out this pincer for the XP. Use pluck. Storm throw doesn't affect Helen. That's right, pincer. Magikarp 
Magneto grew to 49. Lock on. I think we're going to keep our old moves. <laughs> you transferred your Necrozma over and you caught it in the new game with Repeat Ball. That's pretty smart. I like that move, Christian. I'll just transfer it over and then since I already have it, let's use a Repeat Ball. I like that. I don't have it at all, so I can't do that right now. Go, Helen! So after this, how much longer until we can get into the Pony Canyon? Because I really want a Magnezone. Really want to get a Magnezone. <laughs> I've been looking forward to Magnezone like this whole playthrough, and we haven't gotten them yet. Because I'm guessing after this, we have to go down and deal with like a cutscene and stuff with the legendaries. Like Lunala, probably, right? Lunala, and then after that, then we gotta do whatever. I'm close. I'm close. I like that. I like being close. I wanna. It's like, man, I really want that. <laughs> I really want that a Magnezone. I think I said before, but I've never had a Magnezone, and I really, really want one. Get to flute. Yeah, I gotta get to flute. I was just helping this executor out. They're happy now, I guess. At least one of the faces is happy. One of the coconuts. Is there any... Or are there any fun Pokemon in the grass? Oh, an executor appeared. I kind of want one. Fish boy, welcome back. Executor has frisk. All right, let's go ahead, use a pluck. Hopefully it doesn't do a ton of damage. I would like to catch this guy. Oh yeah, we can do it twice. Egg bomb, doesn't affect Helen. <laughs> Wood hammer, not very effective. All right, let's go ahead and... Oh, no, he knocked himself out. Daggone it. <sighs> we were close. We were really close. He was only like, just a sliver of health, but then he knocked himself out with recoil. Dang it. Ooh, Stone Edge. Heck yeah. Let's see. Rock Slide. I don't know. What do you guys think? You think we should keep Stealth Rock? Should we get rid of Rock Slide? We should probably get an additional move onto Ragnarok. <laughs> so what do you guys think? You think Stone Edge over Rock Slide? Let's see, Rock Slide. So Stone Edge... I mean, it's definitely more powerful. If we ever use Ragnarok for doubles, we can hit both of the opponents with Rock Slide. But do we really need Stealth Rock? These are important questions that we gotta ask ourselves. Stone Edge is better for 1v1. Yeah. I agree, Stone Edge is better for 1v1. It's pretty much all I'm doing at the moment. Alright, I'll fish rock slide. If I ever wanted to, I guess I could just go grab a heart scale and relearn it. But it's not like this <laughs> this Gigalith is gonna be very good at competitive battles anyway. It was just a random just a random Pokemon that I caught. Just a random uh Oh my gosh. Beldum? Right? No, not Beldum. Oh my gosh, my mind. I have trouble sometimes. Uh, what was it? Gosh. Oh 
Rug and roll a ah, rug and roll a yes. <laughs> I couldn't remember what it was. I just use synthesis. I don't know why, but I use synthesis. Your like button is broken. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know how to fix a like button. Worry seed. I guess if you call for help. Got another execute. Um, spirit shackle. Let's try that. All right, knocked out one execute. Helen leveled up, level forty-nine. Feather dance. I don't think we need feather dance. Nah, it's okay. Let's forget about that. Feather dance is not important to us. Keep old moves. Ooh, 10 likes and it starts working and turns into a rainbow color. Oh my goodness, I want to see that. So we need 10 likes. There's only four people watching right now. All right, so we another execute. Yeah, let's try pluck. And in the yellow. It's not true. Oh, that's no fun, Multi. I wanted it to be true. Let's see a rainbow colored light button. Let's try a leaf blade. Just want to do a little bit of damage. Too much. Too much. I was entertaining thoughts of catching that execute, but it didn't work. Alright, let's try like one more encounter around here. What is it? What is it? The answer is... Pelipper. Alright, that's disappointing. We caught a Pelipper last night. Started to rain. And Spirit Shackle. You get shiny luck? Ooh, shiny luck. more spirit shackle and come on take it out give me that sweet sweet XP <laughs> hit that like button for shiny luck I like it I like it all right so let's see here not this way let's go this way there's another executor are you happy Oh, the executor lifted you up in thanks. Fantastic. Can we use Stoutland to search around here? Oh, Rotom is sad. Good call. Thank you. Oh, now he's happy. And he's giving us a Roto Lodo. Roto Lodo. Roto Lotto. Are you still hunting Zekrom? Right? Is that what you're going for? You're going for Zekrom? Roto encounters? What does that do? Helps helps you run into high level wild Pokemon more often. Minecraft, hello, how are you? Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for saying hello. You're averaging one shiny a day, still going for Zekrom. Gotcha. Yeah, I know there was at least a couple days in there where you were banging them out. Like you were doing really well. That one. Let's go ahead and hop on to Tauros. You're doing good? Good to hear. Glad. I'm glad you're doing well. 
Let's uh, hop on Stoutland. Oh, right there. Oh, there's a shiny something. Shiny something. We have Stardust. Anything else around here? Yes, there is. Somewhere. Somewhere. Right there. PP up. Hey, that's a good one. You opened your first Pokemon cards box. Did you get any good pulls? And what set were they? I haven't opened Pokemon cards in a while, to be honest with you. I used to, when I say used to, it's probably been a year or two now. I was pretty into them. I, I, had, I bought several like packs of cards and stuff. I buy a pack or two a week and I was big into the Pokemon um, TCG game. I don't know if you guys ever played it or not, but they have it on the computer and you can play online against other people. And I played a lot of that. It was a lot of fun. But I haven't bought a pack of cards in over a year now. Office hunting rock rough still. Guzzlord set. You got a Ho Oh GX. Ooh, nice. You have the Mewtwo GX? That's cool. Cameron, hello, how are you? You want mm. Alpha wants a shiny dust like and rock. Taking the flute. Yeah, I used to collect, like when I was younger, especially, I used to collect the cards like crazy. I haven't gotten. I mean, I guess a couple years ago I was pretty into them and I had several, but not as many as I did when I was younger. Shiny charm, don't fail me. <laughs> Tomorrow is your birthday? Happy early birthday, Minecraft. I hope that you have a good birthday. How old are you going to be? Oh, yeah. We got the flute now. I think I think I saw something in there that said we could go into the Pony Canyon now. Bass Pony Canyon. Fantastic. Magnazone, here we come. Alright, let's head up here. We need to take a right and then head around this way. Cramble. Intimidate. There, let's get some XP. Um, just for a leaf blade. Use rage, doesn't affect Helen. Leaf blade again to finish you off. And there's some XP. A thousand. Not too bad. Davy Jones, group 49. And down around here, up, up, oh, berries, Get some berries. Come on, citrus berry, I want citrus berries. Tanga, a cassid berry. Okay. And down around, down around, down around. Yeah, okay, over here. There we go. All right, so Pony Canyon up this way. Uh oh, Team Skull. Mashado Gen Seven, yeah. Did you guys get your Marshado when they had the event? Is that a GameStop one? I can't remember. I got, I got one. Or two? Did I get one or two? I got at least one. Can't remember if it was a GameStop card.
It was GameStop. You wanna fight, Grunt? Let's fight. You're my shadow and has terrible nature? I don't remember what mine was. I don't remember. I think I did a video. But I don't remember what mine was. An Ekans? Really? You don't have an Arbok? Over 45 Ekans. Okay. I guess I'll just Spirit Shackle you. I should have stopped by the Pokemon Center while I was there. You've hatched 34 eggs so far? Ekans is down. Defeated the grunt. Don't look so surprised. They always look so surprised. Do we have to fight all of these grunts? Oh, there's Plumeria. Join the Steam Rocket. Choose your starter, a Rattata. A Rattata or a <laughs> Rattata, Rattata or Rattata. 661 eggs? Wow, Christian. I saw 686. Charm and Masuda. Wow. A faux mantis, huh? This guy's actually got five Pokemon. Are they all like Fomantis? Five Fomantis? One hit KO. Houndur? Uh, David Jones, I think, wants to fight. Davy Jones, I choose you. You send out that Houndour. I'm not sure the Houndour is going to like what Davy Jones has to offer. One in 584. Eradicate, huh? Jones in. Oh, I got the burn. <laughs> Double edge. Still the only like? Have you tried refreshing your page? Ah, oh, burn got him. Marini. Let's send out Magneto. So we got a Marini out there. We've got Magneto is going to hit it with a discharge, and Marini is going to be like, "Oh, hello, Chi Chi, how are you? Thanks for stopping by." Golbat, let's just stick in with Magneto.
One hit KO. Goodbye, Golbat. <laughs> they always look so surprised. Like, do we seriously have to fight all these guys, or... Was that like the last one? Now we gotta fight Plumeria or something? Come on, Plumeria, let's go. I like how I'm being threatened and my character's just smiling like, it's okay, it's okay, I'm gonna beat you. So Mary is chill right now. Your like button went into the negatives? No, not the negative likes. I'd help one another out. We've learned in Alola. We gotta say, Mr. Guzma. <laughs> Could you help us save Guzma? Uh, maybe. Funny's entertainment. I can remember. It's probably been a couple weeks ago, Alpha, when one of the last times I was streaming some arc, and you're about the only one that was hanging out. Oh, we got a poison MZ. Now can we finally go into Vast Pony Canyon, please? I gotta get a Magna Zone. Yes, there it is. However, I feel like we should see Magneto. His XP was close to leveling up. I kind of feel like shouldn't waste that XP. Or we, you know, we just level him up into Canyon. There's probably some grass in there to, f to use, right? To fight? See, even when you're the only one? Yeah. Chi Chi says the first, he's the first one. <laughs> Got the first like on the stream. Alright, so we're in Vast Pony Canyon. Um, okay, what's going to happen here? Oh, Rotom's sad? Oh, he is sad. Good call. Did everything go well? Well, I... I guess it went well? I mean, we got the flu. Doesn't matter. Stuff's going on all around me. Things are getting crazy, but my character's happy. He's smiling. Now we got these guys coming back. The guy's always playing with his mustache. Situation with Necrozma. If I am strong enough, then we can do it. Um, okay. We're battling, huh? Alright. Okay then, let's fight.
10,000 magnets? <laughs> How was that? Was it pretty fun? It would be very cool if I got a shiny... How do you guys say that? Is it Poi Pole? I have, don't think I've heard anybody say the name. I'm going to call it Poi Pole. She's funny. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Uh, thunder Wave. Sounds like a good idea. Let's Thunder Wave. You were jealous? Yeah, 10,000 magnets sound pretty fun. Were they like the rare earth ma the rare earth magnets or something? <laughs> oh, I got you. I got you. Like a Jersey accent. Foible. Uh, okay, so he's paralyzed. Let's go ahead and discharge. Okay, that did nothing. Nasty plot. He's getting buff. Uh, maybe a flash cannon? Let's try that. Yeah, did like nothing. Nasty plot. Yeah, it's setting up on me. Um, shoot. We're probably gonna lose Magneto here. At least Poipol is paralyzed. Kind of fishing around for what does the most damage. Let's try another. Yeah, yeah. I was thinking about axes too. Um, I was afraid of switching in and then getting hit and having axes KO'd. So I was thinking about just letting Magneto go down. I guess it doesn't matter because Poipol is hitting me or hitting Magneto and did like nothing. So that was my that was my fear question was switching into axes. And then Axis just getting like one hit KO'd. So I'd maybe wait until, if I have to switch into Axis, just wait until Magneto goes down. How many Pokemon have I caught in all? Ooh. That's a good question. I don't know. Like on this game or ever, I played all the games. Seriously? Seriously? Why'd you use a potion? Hoopa Clash of Ages. Was that the one where Hoopa was going around and be like, Ale Hoopa Ring! Like that? Like Hoopa, like the little Hoopa that sounded like a kid? And then you had the big evil Hoopa? Is that that movie? Because if it is, I've seen that one. But I don't remember what it was called. Psy Twister plus Psychic Unbreakable. Caught 402. Oh, congrats, Alpha. And just this game? Uh, not that many. We could look at my boxes in a little bit. Um, I only have... I have two full boxes and then... Maybe seven or eight in the next box. So, that I guess that answers your question there, doesn't it? Two full boxes with seven or eight in the next box. Well, Magneto has done a great job tanking this poiple. Helps that I have the type advantage. And we got him. I think that's it. 
You're going down, Poiple. I can't help it now. Since Christian's mentioned the Poiple, uh, like the Jersey accent, I just that's how I'm gonna say it now. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say Poiple. You look like Nurse Joy in the game. <laughs> scary games. Ooh, I don't know. No, 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 scary games. I, uh, so I watched a guy play. <gasps> oh, we go. We the evolution. Oh, we're going to get Magnus on. Yee! <laughs> Magnus on. Oh, here it is. Brady, hello. How are you? Why are you mad? Got Magnazone! I'm so excited. This is my first Magnazone. <laughs> Thanks, Chi Chi. There are still people who believe that this Pokemon came from outer space. It emanates a powerful magnetic field. Thanks! Do you know Dewey is why? No, I'm lost. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I am lost. Dewey, I, I'm lost. You guys are like going over my head on that. <laughs> this is astounding. You show such skill. Do I have a Magnezone picture? Did I make a Magnezone picture for this? Do I have one? I don't have a Magnezone. Well, 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 well. I'm going to have to get a Magnezone picture. A dumb meme? Okay. I gotcha. It's a meme. I don't know if you're like... I don't know, like, like you know the way or whatever. I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm behind the times. Okay, meme. <laughs> when the Krasma comes to f attack this world, will you fight it in our place? Yeah, I guess I'll fight it. I'll throw a Pokeball at it. That's what I'll do. Amazing meme. I'm good for right now. Thanks for the offer, Road Tom. I need to actually, speaking of pictures, uh, Ultra Recon Squad are counting on me. Yeah. Alright, so speaking of pictures, I gotta get a new picture of a Magnezone to update Magneto's picture. Let's go over here. not going to be pretty like the others are. I can make it pretty later. But it'll work. And come over here like that. And there. 
There we go. We got Magnezone. Let's actually flip this around. Sweet. We got Magnezone. Rotom. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Roto Y? Uh, sure. Yeah, you call me Roto Y. Roto Y. Rotom and Roto Y. Now, isn't that a great team? And we got a Roto Lotto. I'm getting caught up on the chat. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Rotom backwards is motor? <laughs> it is. They're stealing your job? Oh no, don't steal off his job. The vast canyon. I wonder what we'll find in there. Hopefully we find something really cool, Lily. I want to find something sweet and awesome. Ooh, what is this? Something good? A max revive. That is good. That's a very good item. Thank you, Lily. You found an Aether Paradise? Oh, okay. Alpha's job. Alpha tells me when Rotom is sad. <laughs> oh yeah, thanks for the heal. Take care of Rotom. Rotom, Rotom, Rotom. Alright. So we finally got Magnezone. I am extremely psyched. Heck yeah. I'm still sad though that he has that nature. <laughs> hey guy, you wanna fight my new Magnezone? Tom again? Come on, take it out. You dropped a special defense last turn. Yes, got it. So Rotom's sad again. All right. After this battle, we have to make sure Rotom is happy. Bugsy grew to 46. Davy Jones is 50. Helen is 50. Bayonet. Mm. Give Bugsy a try. You're quitting YouTube? <laughs> Why are you quitting? Don't leave Alpha. Bling. Alpha, come back! Ooh, if I had protect right now, that'd be handy. But I don't have protect.
<laughs> oh, wrong button. I'm gonna do that. And do I assist that? Phantom Force. Oh, wow. Okay. I did a lot more damage than I thought I was going to. Uh, Ragnarok, uh, how about you give her a go? Uh, Stone Edge. Let's give that Stone Edge a try. Phantom Force, dang it. Stone Edge again. Don't break chat rules. I can second that. I don't know. I don't know where Shark's at tonight. They were here yesterday. They changed their name to. Or didn't didn't Shark change over to another account like uh, Alolan Raichu? You know what, Lily? You have the. <laughs> hey, Shark Jake, how are you? Is this your first time here, Shark? I don't think I've seen your name before. If this is your first time, thanks for stopping by. Hope that you are enjoying the stream. Thanks for hanging out with us. Right now we're in the Vast Pony Canyon. Uh, just got Magna Zone, which I'm super psyched about. I've never had a Magna Zone before this, so to finally have one is pretty exciting. I don't, I don't know what P. Loopy is. Another long day of school and cheers you up. Well, good, Chi Chi. Glad we can cheer you up. Roto PP restores. Is Chark still here? Chark, are you still here? Let's go out here. Lily, need some healing. Hello, Lily. He's not coming back. No! Come back, Brady. Tenth grade. Let's see, Pokemon, we need to... I guess we need to get some levels for Bugsy. He's just mad. Well, tell him we don't want him to be mad. Golbat? I don't think we have a go back yet. He wanted you to do something that might give you a warning. <laughs> Lily, are you Brady's fiance? Yeah, yeah, you just said it. Your fiance. Uh, he was telling us the other day, I think it's last week or week before, that. You guys just got engaged. You've been dating for a while. So congrats. I don't know if I don't know if you were around for that or not. I told him congrats, but I told you congrats too. Let's see. Let's go with I'm going to catch Golbat. I 
Maybe Davy Jones for some neutral damage. No, nah, Alpha, you're fine. You don't need to be quiet. You're taking Movie Thursday off? Ah, I gotcha. What movie... What movie would you see? Like, if you were going to go to the movies right now, what would you see? Friday? It's Friday for you? Alright, so we can't escape. Gold bat is burned. Alright, let's go ahead and try an ultra ball, I guess. No, let's try a dusk ball. Yeah, let's try a dusk ball. Oh, it's not Friday? Oh, it's Friday for you. I got you. So you don't have to work tomorrow or you don't have school or whatever? I'm jealous. I have to go to work tomorrow. And at least where I'm at, we're supposed to have a big snowstorm tomorrow. So I'm hoping that we don't have that much snow and that it doesn't affect traffic too much. Because trying to drive and get to and from work when there's any kind of weather, it's terrible. It's terrible. You think you get made of, made fun of because you don't talk and you're quiet? That's not nice. I never, I never liked, never liked bullies. Never, never did. If I was going to the movies, Insidious, oh man, I can't do it. I, props to you, but ooh, I don't like those. College student and it's Thursday. Oh, gotcha. But Lily, I was wondering if maybe like you didn't have classes tomorrow or something, so technically it was your Friday in that you get to take tomorrow off and sleep in or whatever, but. Uh, let's see, so Golbat, they can suck down over 10 ounces of blood in one go. They have been known to drink so much blood that they can no longer fly. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. I didn't mean to give him a nickname, but, hmm, alright guys, what is a good nickname for a female Golbat, and go. Never been bullied, much worse. Yeah, I don't know, I don't have anything good to say about bullies. Celine? I like that. Like Underworld, right? Like Underworld? Celine? I like that. Celine, that's good. You don't like scary movies, but at the same time, you like scary movies? I gotcha. Pat girl. <laughs> Uh, summary. Inner focus. It's not bad. Ooh, and we got increased speed, but decreased special defense. Hmm. Mean look, leech life, haze, and venom shock. Okay. Alright, let's send to a box. Yes, underworld. I like those two. Have you seen all the Underworlds? How many are there? Are there like four or five now? Something like that? Yeah, I like them too. Pokemon... Bugsies, okay, alright. Hey, hey, let's fight! The five? I don't know if I've seen the most recent one. I don't... 
I don't think I have seen the most recent one. A Spinda? You do have a day off tomorrow and no work? Oh, nice. That's awesome, Lily. I'm jealous. I'm jealous. I gotta go to work tomorrow, so I'm not ha not looking forward to that. You want to make your own Pokemon game so bad? It's a snow blizzard right now. The original evolution, Rise of the Lycans, Awakening, and the new one. Yeah, I think I've only seen up to Awakening. I haven't seen the new one. And like you, I don't remember what it was called. Uh, we got a Spinda over there. Let's just hit it with a Pollen Puff. I usually don't talk to one person and I... I got you. Rather be outside doing other things, but you're snowed in. Yeah. It was pretty nice here today. Like, it was about 60 or so today. And then tomorrow it's going to be, like, cold and snowy. So, like, quite the opposite. Well, Alpha, like, if you ever feel sad or anything and you need to talk, you know, there's always Discord. You can always talk to us on Discord and everything. Love to hang out with you. And kind of talk and have conversations and everything. The first two plus the prequel Rise of the Lycans were good. Yeah. Yeah. I really liked Rise of the Lycans. I liked it a lot. And I, I agree. The uh, Underworld Awakening... It was, it was okay, and I haven't seen the new one. I have not seen the new one. You're outdoor guys? I like to be outdoors. Lies, rise of the Lycan Rocks. <laughs> Alpha, I give that two thumbs up. I like that. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> oh, Rotom is sad? Okay. Ooh, a Doug Trio. Hmm. <laughs> let's see. Let's get... What do you call a crazy cow on the loose? Primal Cheeseburger, hello, how are you? Is this your first time here? Because I don't think I've seen your name before. And I think I would remember because cheeseburgers are like my favorite food. Lycan Rock is awesome, so why not? Yeah. Lily and Brady love to travel. Amazing race. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? Oh, okay. So a mad cow on the loose is a utter, utter destruction. I got you. I got you. That's a knee slapper. I can appreciate that. Do we miss a bulldoze? Or what happened there? Oh, use dig. I got you. You have a box full of shiny Pokemon from Warholes. Nice. Single battle, winner gets a shiny moo shiny mew, that's legit. What? Oh, we knocked out the Doug Trio. Oh well. I don't think there's anything else on here, is there?
<laughs> the guy that stole the calendar. Stole the calendar. He got 12 months. That's funny. I didn't mean to use Absorb. How do you keep a Rhino from charging? I don't know. How do you keep a Rhino from charging? I feel like these are very important questions. Magneto. Take away its credit card. <laughs> All right. You're the Joker in your relationship? <laughs> I can appreciate that. I'm usually the Joker uh, with my wife, so I can I can appreciate the Joker. Usually she just rolls her eyes at me like, really? Alright, so we're in here and we got into another encounter. I'm not sure where to go from here. I don't know if we're in a dead end. Uh, let's go ahead and Ragnarok out. Let's go ahead and knock out that Doug Trio for some XP. Yeah, um, Primal, there is a link to Discord down in the description. So you can always head over there and join up there and post some stuff in. Oh, dig. Dang it. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention and I got Ragnarok knocked out. Uh, yeah, let's use the next Pokemon. Uh huh. Davy Jones. And go for Scald. I, I got you, Alpha. I got you. I see what you're saying. And Rotom said, speaking of Alpha. <laughs> oh, you gotta leave, Chi Chi? Alright. Have a good night. Thanks for hanging out. Hope to see you in the next stream. Roto Lotto. And what do we get? Yeah, Alpha is sad. <laughs> oh. Alright, so... I think... Oh no, I, I didn't go down this way. Hmm. <laughs> I actually need to go outside, get Lily. To heal up my team, because I got Ragnarok knocked out. 
Good night, Chi Chi. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, yeah, sure. We should. Let's go ahead and save. Picked on since kindergarten. Alpha, that's sad. That, that's no fun at all. I'm sorry to hear you've been picked on. You going to calm down Brady? Okay. Oh, look at that. A bull door. He's still really mad. That's no point now. Boldor call for help. Knock it out. Bugsy is 47. All right. Oh, Pokeball. Max Potion. We should actually hop on to our Stoutland. Any items? Oh, yep. Over here somewhere. Over here. There. Gaming Granny, hello, how are you? We are playing through Pokemon Ultra Moon. I actually have not beaten the game yet, so I am working on that at the moment. I actually have gotten as far as Pony Canyon, and right now I'm just kind of going through here. Battling trainers. Catching some Pokemon, hanging out with you guys in the chat, just kind of relaxing. So how are you, Gaming Granny? Don't think I've seen you in here before. I'm not the oldest person anymore. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> You're new? Well, I'm glad that you're here. I'm glad you're hanging out with us. Hope that you enjoy the stream. We're usually pretty chill. We like to just kind of hang out. Be casual. Snow warning. But my sand stream comes in. So, that was nice. Those... Don't want to use bulldoze. Let's use Stone Edge. On to the Ninetales. And then let's use Flash Cannon on to the Sand Slash. Come on, Ragnarok. Take it. Take it to the limit. Metal Claw. Ragnarok. Alright, he's alive. Stone Edge, come on, hit. One hit KO. One hit KO. Yeah. In that situation, yes, it does. Which worked out well for me. <laughs> Otherwise, we would have had to deal with the hail. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and Stone Edge the sand slash hopefully magnezone can survive or not magnezone but ragnarok well you know what the flash cannon might finish it off yeah we got it cool i do really like the alolan forms of sand sand slash and nine tails i think they're pretty cool All 
Alright. Any other items around here? I don't think so. How are the Pokemon? We should heal up a little bit. You know what? Probably gonna run into some Pokemon on the way out, but I'm gonna go out to Lily and have her heal me up. Save a potion. Ooh, a Carbink. Did I ever catch a Carbink? I never caught a Carbink. Hmm. Well, let me try hitting it with a Bulldoze. Guard split. Okay. <sighs> Don't want to knock it out. Chat died. I know, right? I guess if you guys are interested, we could always play the game we were playing last night. If you want. Trying to decide. I like to catch that carving. I, I think Stone Edge might do too much. We're gonna find out. Oh yeah, we actually <laughs> did too much damage. Uh, the battle with Ultra Necrozma nears after you leave the canyon and reach the altar. Good luck. Ooh. Okay. If that is the case, Christian, I should go stock up on Pokeballs. Because I don't think I have that many. Bunch of trainers first. Oh, you cannot catch Ultra Necrozma? I got you. Okay. It's only battle. Oh, okay. So basically, it's like... Basically, it's like a... A totem battle. Stone Edge. Oh, you'll catch Necrozma on your way to Elite Four. Gotcha. Okay. I got you. I got you. Lily. Oh, you know what? I didn't notice before, but it looks like you go under that tree. Is there a TM back there? I think there's a TM back there. There is. What is it? Wild Charge? Hey, that's not too bad. We should... I was just thinking, we need to get a better moveset onto... On, onto Ragnarok here. Mm, flash Cannon. Just let me check real quick. Ragnarok? Hello, Bara... Barak? Barak? How are you? Is your first time here? I don't think I've seen your name before. If this is your first time, thanks for hanging out. Um, Pokemon. Let's check out the stats of Ryan Rock. I think he's a physical attacker, isn't he? If you don't know, Yeah, physical attack. Okay. Download it on the eShop. Hmm. Slide. Tomb. Roost. Skull. Snarl time. Yeah, maybe 
even though I know her. Ash Greninja? Ash Greninja School. Can you still get the Ash Greninja? Because that's something I never got. I need to. If you can still get that, I should do that because I haven't gotten it yet. I do like Ash Greninja. Alpha's got Ash Greninja. Oh, okay. Free demo. Still get it. Alright, I need to do that. I need to get that demo. You don't have Sun and Moon? Gotcha. Bulky Bank. Oh, so you have to transfer it to Sun and Moon from the demo. Can you transfer it to Ultra Sun and Moon? I imagine you probably could, couldn't you? Not sure about that? Yeah, I don't know. I need to download that while it's still available. Because I do want to get Ash Ninja. Safety is not found. Well, that's not good. Oh, Rotom said. Rotolotto. You can trade it up, but to get Ash Greninja, you have to buy Sun or Moon. Okay. So I'm going to the eShop. I didn't. I don't know if anyone else has bought it on the eShop or not. I have physical copies. Got mine at GameStop. Let's see. Tauros. Anything around here? Pull out Stoutland. Nothing? Really? Nothing? Huh. Coffee of Sun. So no, no, I have them on physical copy. I bought both of mine at GameStop. I uh, I bought myself Pokemon Sun, and then uh, my wife wanted Moon, so I bought her Moon. It's a little better.
Uh, go that. Uh, Stone Edge. Avoided the attack? Of course he avoided the attack. Come on, go back. Come get you some. There we go. Goodbye, Golbat. Going through to 51. Oh, need Tauros again. Stardust. Can you can you get it from the e shop? I guess you probably could, couldn't you? Oh, Pokeball. No, I don't I don't have on the eShop. I bought mine at GameStop. Let's see, stat one. Any items? I don't think so. You can? Okay. I, th I thought you probably could, but I wasn't sure exactly. Carbink. We need to heal up Ragnarok. He has taken quite a bit of damage. The <laughs> holy mod. <laughs> All right, I think he uses within range. Let's try. Let's try for. I guess Ultra Ball. Fingers crossed. All right, we caught Carbink. Oh, you have Ultra Sun. Gotcha. Carbink. To keep the jewels on their bodies free of tarnish, packs of carving use their soft manes to polish one another's jewels. Yeah, you should be able to transfer the Ash Greninja to your Ultra Sun. You can't trade it from the demo to Ultra Sun and Moon. I got you. But I guess if somebody already has it on Sun, they could probably trade it that way, couldn't they? Could you... I wonder if you could ask for it in... in the, in the Global Trade Clear Body. Baby Diancy. Speaking of that alpha, did you see the the Diancy movie where they had a ton of Carbink and they were all kind of like guardians of Diancy? You can't GTS for Ash Ninja. Ah, okay. We should heal up our Ragnarok real quick. Let's go over here. Where are my 
Hyper potions. There we go, hyper potion. Gotta get off Stoutland. Nope. X attack. You saw the movie? Huh. You couldn't change your own tempo, Rock Ruffs. I would have thought that would work, but hmm, guess not. Uh, let's see. Hey, guy, let's fight. I don't think you can hash Ash Ninjas, can you? Boot tops. That's pretty cool. All right, and we slowed it down. Hopefully we can attack first this time and knock it out. Nope. It endured? Oh. Yeah, I'll switch. Bugsy. I don't have any Ash Greninjas. I have zero Ash Greninjas. Can you GTS for Ash Greninja? Sounds like a Google question. Google. Looks like you might be able to put it on GTS. <laughs> it's hacked but still legal? <laughs> How does that work?
<laughs> this comes irritating you? Okay, so we beat the hiker, I guess. I got distracted. <laughs> You're leaving? Alright, Barack. Thanks for hanging out. Hope to see you again in the future. Hope that you have a good night. Or a good day, wherever you are. Hate Zekrom shiny, yet I compelled yourself to get it. <laughs> I got my fingers crossed for you. Hope you can get it, Christian. Oh. Roto la Roto Y. Roto Lotto. Oh, to tell if it's shiny. Yeah, because the shiny is really similar to the the regular sprite. You memorize the differences? Shiny Mark M Macargo number five? Wow. <laughs> Alpha, I still need to watch that video. You, you sent a link over in Discord the other day, and I haven't watched it yet. I still need to. You said something about somebody was using a shiny something that couldn't be gotten, right? I still need to go watch that. I meant to, and I keep getting distracted. Shiny has blue eyes instead of red. Okay, I got you. Oh, it was a shiny Hoopa, that's right. <laughs> Wink. All a Hoopa ring! So if you guys had to pick, like, your favorite Pokemon movie, what would it be? Favorite Pokemon movie? I think for me, it would probably be Pokemon Movie 2000. I like that one quite a bit. Oh, now I wish I had the uh, the rock slide. Mystery of the Unknown. Ah, this is a good one. With Entei. Yeah, I remember that. I think I've only seen that one once. to the theater with your dad to see it. I gotcha. Got the Entei promo card. I never had the Entei promo card. Yeah, kind of like you know, what you're talking about, you know, going to the theater with your dad to see it. Kind of the same thing with me. Um, with Pokemon the first movie I went with my parents to see it it had already been out for a while and we went to one of those I, mean, I don't know if they still have them around or not but it was like one of those like cheap I don't know dollar or five dollar theaters that show movies that have been out for a while 
Um, we went and saw it there. And I can remember that earlier that day, like we had went to a toy store and I had gotten, I don't have them with me, um, but I don't know if you remember or not, there used to be like little keychains, like Pokemon that were in a Pokeball and they were a keychain. Like the the keychain went into the Pokemon and it's like screwed into the Pokemon. I would gotten a couple of those. I used to like those a lot because you could open the Pokeball up, it's kind of like spring loaded and the Pokemon was, would fit inside. I always took the keychain off just because I would like put the Pokeballs on my belt or something and walk around with them like that. Really? Uh, yeah, the first three movies, you remember those? Yeah, I had a bunch of those. I still do, actually. I have them at my mom's house. Um, yeah, those those are cool. I always like those. Um, I had a bunch of them, too. Dancing in the Cocoon of Destruction. Oh, really? They had them in vending machines. I just remember, at least the ones that I got, they had them in packages at the toy stores. And, you know, it was just, it was just a simple package, you know? Like, that big or whatever, and had the Pokeball there and the Pokemon in it. And uh, I had several. I had, like, a... A Kadabra, a Pikachu, there was a Bulbasaur, a Charizard, an Eevee, and some others too. I don't remember all of them. The Nostalgia? I know, right? <laughs> I've got a lot of fun memories of of, of Pokemon. Um, like <laughs> when I was younger, so I grew up in the country, um, and I lived like out on a farm, and there was lots of, you know, farmlands around. I would go out, you know, out in out in the field or out in the yard as a kid, and I would play Pokemon. Right, I had those little Pokeballs, just like I was talking about, the little keychains. I'd try to, I'd, I'd put them on my belt or whatever, and I would walk around, and pretend that I was. You know, playing Pokemon. Or I was a Pokemon trainer. Um, kind of one of my, like my running, my running, I guess theme or like setting was that I lived on like a huge Pokemon, kind of like almost like a safari, like the the safari in red, blue, and yellow. Um, it's kind of like that in my head. It was huge though, and it was like. It was a huge lake, and there was an island in the middle of the lake, and it was all that kind of stuff. And so I would pretend that I was there, and I would run around trying to catch different Pokemon. <laughs> no, I didn't throw any Pokeballs at animals. Funny thing, I... Crap, you know what? I don't have Stone Edge anymore. Dang it. Let's go ahead and set up Stealth Rock. Um... So, you know the uh, the pressure gauges that you can use on your cars to check your tire pressure? Like you put it on the uh, on the spout and it shoots out and tells you how much tire pressure you have? I used to pretend that one of those was like a uh, like a level checker. <laughs> like you would like I would I had carry one on my belt or my vest or whatever and I'd pretend that I went up to a Pokemon and like you hit it and then like I would just kind of randomly pull the gauge down. Oh, it's level 36. <laughs> I don't know. It was silly, but it was fun as a kid. Now let's go with Helen. So yeah, I did that kind of stuff. And uh, like my dad was a custodian. So I would spend a lot of after school time kind of there. Um, he was a custodian at a church, and there wasn't a whole lot for me to do. I'd do my homework, and then after that, it was kind of just kind of left up to my imagination. So I would, you know, I would draw. I'd draw a lot of Pokemon pictures. 
Oh, Helen, no! Lost Helen. Um, I drew Pokemon pictures. I would draw, like, a map. <laughs> like, like, um... Let's see, Magnus on, I guess. I, would, I drew, like, a map of the safari that I was just talking about. Um, different stuff like that. Um, and also, in that church, there was, like, a fellowship hall. It was, like, a huge room that they would have gatherings, you know, like meals or, or whatever. Sometimes they'd put on shows. There was a stage in there. So I pretend that it was a stadium, and I would go up on the stage, and I was like the gym leader. <laughs> you know, people would kind of challenge me. I was a gym leader. <laughs> so it was, eh, I don't know. It was fun. In my realm of Pokemon, I was a Pokemon champion and had every Pokemon. It's awesome, Alpha. It's funny, because in my realm of Pokemon, I was also <laughs> the champion. I didn't have all the Pokemon, but I did have a Mew. I had a Mew, and nobody knew I had a Mew, because it was always my last Pokemon, and nobody could get to my last Pokemon. So it was always, like, huge speculation. What's his last Pokemon? We've never seen his last Pokemon. I don't even know what my team was. My team was like Gyarados. Obviously, Gyarados was on the team. Like Gyarados, Tyranitar, Charizard, Venusaur. Um, Mew. Yeah, I don't remember. Who was, who was the sixth? Charizard, Gyarados, Tyranitar, Mew, Venusaur. I don't remember the sixth one. You had friends as a kid. Oh, Pokemon League. Oh, nice. Ah, oh, that sounds fun. You have to go around the town or the go around the neighborhood and battle. That's fun. Oh, we have the paralysis on Kangaskhan. Nice. I totally have not been paying attention to this battle. I've been like just kind of rambling, <laughs> reminiscing. Level 50 for Axis. Dude, gong, gong, gong. All right, discharge, do a ton of damage. We actually outsped Dugong. Oh, nice. I remember the link cables. I had one of those link cables. Uh, the one that I had, like on one of the ends, it had like a split so it could go to either the Game Boy Color or the original Game Boy, which was handy because I started off with one of the brick Game Boys, like the huge gray ones. And then. Like, I eventually got a Game Boy Color. Which is actually right here. I have my Game Boy Color. Oh, look at this! My old Game Boy Color. I still have it. And it's got Pokemon Red in it. Look. Pokemon Red. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't really. Okay. That's cool. Alright, you know I gotta fire this up. There's there batteries in it? Are there batteries? No, no batteries. I don't have any batteries at my desk. Shoot. Oh, there's my Game Boy Color. I was gonna fire up the, the game, but I don't have any batteries. I think on this game, I had like a level 80 something or 90 Gyarados. Because even back in those days, Gyarados was my favorite. Alpha, Alpha's team was Mew, Mewtwo, Charizard, Arcanine, Gyarados, and Alakazam. You like psychic types. You know, one the splits? You had one too? I have both of my Game Boys still. I only have my Game Boy Color with me. My original Game Boy is still at my mom's house. I know where it's at, I just... I don't have it with me. I 
kind of wish I had some batteries with me right now. I'd fire up that Game Boy and see what Pokemon were on it. Escape rope. All right, we need to use an elixir and we need to use a revive. All right, max revive. Use that on Helen. Let's use Hyper Potion on Ragnarok, on Magneto, and we need an Elixir or something. Ether? Yes, yeah, using Ether. Ragnarok on Stone Edge. And actually, you know what? We should use a PP up on Stone Edge. Okay. I don't know if they still work or not. Um, I know that one of my Pokemon Silver versions died. I had two. One of my friends when I was in middle school actually gave me his Pokemon Silver. So I had two. One of them, I don't remember which one it was, but one of them died. The last time that I checked that Pokemon Red, it still worked, but it's probably been... It's probably been two years since I've even tried to check that that cartridge. So I hope it still works. Fan of Ghost-type in your realm. You, did, you don't know why I didn't have Ghost-type. Get off. Yeah, so speaking of in your realm, like also in my realm, when when I was playing, I had this huge, I mean, we're talking gigantic stadium. And the name of the stadium was my real last name, International Super Stadium. So it'd be like Yo Yo Y2K International Super Stadium. And like the main stadium itself was gigantic. Like the actual stadium was super tall and it had like uh, like really sturdy plexiglass, whatever, all around the stadium. There were, of course, like Coliseum type seating all around it. There were walkways and windows. Uh, the top was like a dome, had like stained glass and stuff. And there was a like a separate stadium that was within that same stadium, but kind of off to the side. And it was like the champions stadium, since I was the champion, obviously. I had my own little champion stadium. And it was just kind of elegant. It looked kind of like a like Roman style. It was white, had columns. And that's where I would do like my title defenses. <laughs> And then out from that, so you had that main stadium that was combined. You had like the huge like stadium and then you had like the champion stadium. And then like going off, like branching, and actually it was, it branched and it was moving sidewalks that would take you out to other stadiums that were like themed. So you'd have like a grass stadium or you'd have a rock stadium or you'd have like a water stadium and they were a lot smaller they were they weren't huge they were just you know more like fields that still had decent seating um and we actually kind of i kind of built it on pixelmon that's one of the things that i was saying if we ever if i can ever get um my friend to fire up the old pixelmon server might have to go check that out with you guys because i I built it on on that on Pixelmon, which Pixelmon is just Minecraft. It didn't I mean it didn't look exactly like I had in my mind, but the same kind of idea. Like it was like a little city in there. There were restaurants. There was like a hotel in there. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. And then we we ended up building fields that ran off from the main stadium. It was pretty sweet. I gotta get that fired up sometime. I'd love to show you guys. We got a Mawile. 
Like that stadium was really cool. Um, I might have a few pictures I could put in Discord. I think I have some pictures somewhere. I'll take a look and see if I can find some pictures of it. And if I can, I'll try to post them in Discord so you can see them. But yeah, there was there was like a grassy area inside the stadium. Like you went in the door. And then there's like a grassy area. There was a little lake. Not a lake, but like a little pool. And then there was like a fountain in the pool. And there's like a waterfall coming down from the second floor down to the first floor. It was cool. Since most of your Pokemon were mostly psychic, there was walls you had to climb. Oh, you walk upside down. That's fun. That's a good idea, Alpha. That's fun. Yeah, and to be perfectly honest, like when I was imagining all this stuff, I was I was like still your age, Alpha. I was like twelve, you know, <laughs> having fun, like out in my yard and and whatnot, just imagining all these battles and all the Pokemon. So yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I was. I was still your age when I was imagining all that stuff. Weavile, uh, switch Pokemon. Wait, no, Weavile's ice. Uh, I probably can't outspeed it though. Magneto. Which I need him. <laughs> Flash Cannon. And boom! Goodbye. Super effective. never truly grow up no you don't you're yeah, you don't that's good though you don't want to oh TM dazzling gleam hey that's fantastic that'll be helpful yeah like my mom she's getting up there she actually turned 72 this year um, and she's always like you know, my body feels like I'm 72, I guess, but like my mind, I don't feel 72. And I think that's great because as long as you can kind of think of yourself as being young, you kind of keep that mindset, I think that's good. And bulldoze. Oh, of course it would use a dig. I should use iron defense, shouldn't I? So what are you guys' favorite... Like, do you guys have a favorite team that you use for competitive battles? Like, is, do you have, like, a go-to team? Like, uh... You know, whatever. Quiver dance, huh? Take a look here. Night Fox! Hello, how are you? How are you, Night Fox? It's been a while. Good to have you back, Night Fox. You're doing good? That's good to hear. Glad you are doing good. I made it to the Pony Canyon, so I'm taking a look around here right now. Guessing I gotta go across this way. Probably should heal up. Oh, oh, Tom. How much farther before we get to uh, Ultra Necrozma? Oh, 
have you been in school? <laughs> uh, we're friends. Yeah, we're friends. Hal was a cool guy. I like Hal. I take it you're not a fan of school. <laughs> Just going out on a limb. Just going out on a limb and taking a wild guess. Roto Lotto time. Okay. Roto boosts. Marshadow, Mimikyu, Lycanroc, an Ultra Beast, Lugia, and Pukumuku. Do you have like a VGC team that you use, Alpha? Guys, are we getting close to Ultra Necrozma? Type is Necrozma anyway. Let's do this. Psychic Dragon. Gonna go in half an hour. Yeah, I'll probably have to head out before half an hour. Okay. So a psychic dragon. I'm thinking I might need to go back and grab some strong... <sighs> da -da 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 -da. We are pretty far into the canyon though. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Sonic, hello, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Lily. Phew, this king can truly is a difficult path to walk. What have you been up to, Sonic? Oh, you still have the trial involving Como first. Okay. Alright, that's reassuring. <laughs> Lily, <laughs> you're always getting yourself into trouble. Oh, silly Murkrow. Oh, good job. She ran right past him. Oh. Hey, yo, yo, look, I did it. I made it across. I want to fight together with Pokemon and become strong enough to outdo you myself. Yeah! We have the option to tell her that she had a long way to go. That's not very nice. I like Lily. Lily's nice. You know, I just used a ton of potions and stuff. I should have just waited. Oh, 
We're about to get ambushed. Ooh, a nugget! I like nuggets. Ambush. What is the ambush? A Doug Trio. Okay. Should have seen that coming. Gotcha. One hit kill. Fish boy, welcome back. What have you been up to? Ooh, a big group. Yeah, you're back. Been up to anything fun? Not a whole lot has changed here. We're in Pony Canyon. got Magnazone. I don't know if you're around for Magnazone or not. But we have Magnazone, finally. You were punished. Why were you punished? Oh, I used Iron Defense. Didn't mean to use Iron Defense. Gold bats. <laughs> uh, another one appeared. Follow you everywhere. I'm gonna try to run. Couldn't get away. Of course, I couldn't get away. I need a rock slide right now. That changes were eliminated. Cool. It auto corrected to that. MQ zones. <laughs> Got away safely. <laughs> okay, so I'm not sure which way we're supposed to go with this. Maybe down. Let's go down with it. Oh, B. Oh yeah, then we gotta go down again. Ooh, Pokeball. All right guys, just to give you a warning, I've got about 15 minutes left. I was able to get on about the time I usually aim for, so gives about an extra half hour than what we had been. Trying to go for about a two and a half hour stream. What are you guys up to? <laughs> it's getting really quiet in the chat. I know you guys are all intently watching. It's like, oh, yo, yo, don't mess up. Don't mess up. Well, you have you have a right to be worried. That one goes there, right? And that one goes up? Yeah, okay. Another Doug Trio. Soft resetting while lurking. <laughs> you have a movie on? What movie?
multitask. Ooh, that's a good movie. Cure for Wellness. Magnet Rise. No, it's okay. Chiorio, actually, Chiorio and I actually went and saw that in theaters. It was weird, but it was pretty cool. With that movie, there were a couple scenes that were... Oh, Rotom sad. There were a couple scenes that were kind of... That kind of bothered me. Um, so the... Like the eel scene... You know, where they're... Yeah, that one. Didn't like that scene. <laughs> I didn't like the tooth pulling scene. Nope, didn't like that. And then the scene at the end, like after the wedding, whatever. Didn't like that one. Shutter Island. You're right, they are similar. I don't know which one I prefer. A few scenes with the eels. Yeah, the one where they're forcing them down their throats. That one. <laughs> yeah, I didn't like that scene. Ugh. It's a good movie though. It's been a while since I've seen Shutter Island. I saw it back in college. I remember I liked it. Um, I remember the general kind of plot, but I don't really remember a lot of details about it. See, Shutter Island had Leonardo DiCaprio, right? You're at the wedding scene at the other oh, one at the end. Yeah. Yeah, that kind of that whole deal kind of after that wedding scene. Ooh, I don't like that. Shore Island was good. Yeah. DiCaprio. Yeah. So I thought. Hmm. I'm too lazy to walk back out to Lily. I'm just going to use the Hyper Potion. <laughs> uh, trainer. Oh, this guy is talking about Professor Birch. That's a callback to uh, Gen 2. Magnazone. Hey, you got my buddy out. This guy must have just got him a Magnet Zone too. Bulldoze. Sturdy kicked in. But the speed fell, so let's see if we can outspeed it. Can. That should be a lot of good XP right there. Yeah, 1900. That's not bad at all. Helen's 52. Get out. Which one is Get Out? I haven't seen that. Is that is that a horror movie? It sounds like a horror movie. I don't I don't do horror movies. I'm not, I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of horror movies. I'm not gonna lie. I don't like them. Punk girl Anna.
Oh, a comedy. Okay, I got you. Some violence. Okay. Scrafty. A little scary at moments. Oh, high jump kick. Ouch. Oh, that didn't do enough. Well, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Come on. Oh, not enough damage. Yep. Oh, Ragnarok. Sorry. Ooh, Moxie. Buffeted by the Sandstorm. Um, Bugsy, you need some XP. Alright, Bugsy. Just hit with a Pollen Puff. There we go. girl and we lost Ragnarok we do heal up oh uh, okay yeah, thanks thanks Rotom yeah I, I knew that I knew that I was getting some super effective hits against me Got Ragnarok back. Mm -hmm. Let's put Axis up front. A bit silly sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, he is. Hey, punk guy. Let's fight. You gonna fight my Machamp? You know it would be really fun? Is if in the battle they still had Machamp holding you while you were fighting. That would be fun. Pangoro. Alright, well I don't have the type advantage here. Sometimes when you save the game, Roshan will ask you if you want to save the game. <laughs> Alright, so Pangoro, I need to switch out. Hmm. Try Bugsy. My champ fighting while holding you? Hey, there you go. <laughs> that would be fun, wouldn't it? Alright, come on, hit it with a big old pollen puff. Oh, not enough damage. It's alright, we got it. We got it. One more pollen puff will do it. Pangaro's down. 51 for Axis. Crawl Daunt. Let's go Magneto. Charge. Goodbye, Crawdon. See ya. All right, beat the punk guy. Primal cheeseburger. Hello. Welcome back. Have you been here the whole time, Primal? I know you were here earlier.
Oh, you were AFK? I got you. You gotta go, Night Fox. Well, I'm glad you got to hang out for a while. It was good seeing you again. Hopefully, can see you in the next stream. Have a good night. <laughs> All right, see you, Night Fox. Uh, let's just go ahead and run. Probably supposed to actually go that way, maybe. To go around up here. Anything up here? No? No, nothing up here to find. Stoutland, anything to find? Oh, yeah, there was right there. What was it? Over here? I saw it over this way. There. PP Max. Hey, that's good. That's really good, actually. Alright, head down here. Ooh, a Skarmory. We already have a Skarmory. Fighting Pokemon guy because I got psychic type. RNG. I yeah. I'd have to say that I kind of think RNG is a little cheaty. It's not as bad as like some hacking and stuff, but I, I'd still say that it's on the on the cheatier spectrum. It's not as bad as like hacking. It's a new one. Shadow Ball. I might try to catch this. Not too much damage. Oh, critical hit. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I was going to try to catch it, but. Jake Muse, hello, how are you? This your first time here? I don't think I've seen your name before. Unfortunately, you showed up right as I'm getting ready to end the stream. I have to go to bed because I have to get up early and go to work, which is no fun, but gotta make money so I can pay the bills. <laughs> but I'm planning on I'm hoping to be able to stream tomorrow. Um, if you check... So Primal, I know you just checked out the Discord. Jake, there should be a link to a Discord in the description. Um, 
you can head over there. I usually try to um, post when I'm going to be live. You watch the ARC vids, but first stream? Cool. I need to get back to ARC. I haven't played ARC in a while. Um, I know Pokemon ha have... It's been doing well for me recently, so I've been kind of riding that right now. Um, but yeah, like I said, I do need to end the stream. But I'm going to try to be on tomorrow. Um, if I can, I will let you guys know in Discord, so you can check that out. I'm definitely planning on streaming some more this weekend. Um, so hopefully tomorrow. If not tomorrow, then maybe Saturday and or Sunday. So, but yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I need, I need, I need to do some more arc builds. I keep thinking I need to do some more arc, but I like the beach house. Hey, thanks. Beach house was fun. I had a lot of fun with that. You using it? Go for it. That beach house was a lot of fun. Yeah, you go on Discord as well. Yeah, I think. So Jake, I think my favorite build that I've done is actually that um, Adobe Villa. I really like the way that turned out. It was small, but I thought it was it was pretty neat. It was pretty cozy, um, and I liked all the decorations that I put in it. So I think that's probably one of my favorite ones. I like the Adobe. The, I say Adobe Villa. I guess I did two Adobe's. I did an Adobe Villa, and then I also did like the Adobe Outpost. Um, but yeah, both both the Adobe's are fun. Building with Adobe and Greenhouse Glass is my favorite combination on Arc for sure. All right, guys, I'm gonna have to get off here. Thank you for hanging out with me. Hope that you guys have a great day or night wherever you are. Christian, again, thank you for modding. Appreciate it. So yeah, keep an eye on Discord. I'll let you guys know on there when I will be on again. I'm aiming for tomorrow. Fingers crossed. I'll let you guys know. You haven't seen it? Yeah. So there should be two Jake. There is there's an Adobe Villa and there is an Adobe Outpost. They're both cool. I think I think to the Adobe Villa is my favorite. I love that one. Uh, it was pretty cool. So, all right. You guys have a good night. I'll see you in the next stream, hopefully. So, bye, guys.